Hey guys, what up? This is SpiritMonger187 and welcome back for a new match of Shadow Era in 2014. Let's see what we have got here. I'm thinking about sacrificing the full moon, already captured prey, and it's going to be the full moon now. Let's give our opponent the high. Have fun. And let's check out our rating at this point. So we're trying to at least become in the top 100. We have 283 rating. We've reached that with our Amber Rain deck and uh, Dark Claw. And we have almost 10k rating. Uh, let's see what we have here. What are we going to sacrifice? I do think this captured prey is going to be removed. Yeah, and play the Blood Moon. So if we have reached this rating a lot with playing Ember Rain and I just built this Dark Claw deck and I don't think I've ever uploaded a video with a Dark Claw deck before. So it's a pretty new experience here. And it has been working pretty well. I've defeated some Ember Rain decks and um, I defeated the Gravebone deck from a guy who was in the top 12 rating. I don't know his name by now but and we've seen some good news from Shadow Era. They've shown all of the cards of Shattered Fate. So I'll put in this, a link in the description below. So you can see all of the new cards from the new set Shattered Fates. That will come out very soon maybe. Or a beta will be released soon. And I have uh, anticipated with a Kickstarter project. I've donated about $20 or something. And now I will receive some Shadow Crystals and early Beta Access. Um, let's see. So grab our armor. We don't have any pretty nice cards here. So we are going to destroy a Storm of Knowledge now. Mm, but that will cost us a resource. So let's get rid of this one. Destroy his weapon. And we'll attack him in the face. So I don't know how this music is working, just let me know what you think about this music. Maybe it's too loud, maybe it's, but I'm just testing out some new music that I downloaded from YouTube, free to use. And it's a bit different than the music that you always hear from Shadow Era. It's always better, in my opinion, to hear music than to hear nothing. And let's see here. Well, this is pretty nasty. I'm, very badly poisoned with the long wolf. I'm not getting any life, so I'm staying at 24 right now. How it is? So let's hit him in the face once more. So yeah, and I'm trying to reach the top 100 at least, and I think I need like 30k experience now. And it really sucks to reach the top 10. Yeah, I've I've done a little bit of math and. I need to play at least 10 matches a day and win them all if I had like about 300 rating or something. Uh, because uh, if you play 10 matches, oh, let's say your rating is 300 uh, and you gain 3 times your rating, that's 900 points, 900 score points, let's make that a thousand. And you need at least like 300,000 rating points, so that makes 10 matches a day is uh, 10,000 experience a day, or 10,000 score points, uh, times 30 days, so you need to play 30, uh, 10 games each day and win them all. Um, let's see here, well we got nothing really exciting to play, so let's just hit him for one more. Let's shave up our shadow energy. For every drawing a speed strike, which we haven't seen before. And it's good for me that I have removed this tome of knowledge. So yeah, 10 matches a day is pretty m is is a little bit too much for me. I don't think I can reach 10 matches a day. I will try and also do some uploads and making some content for you guys. But yeah, most of the matches, especially when I'm playing this Dark Law match, um, it takes about, let's say, 10 to 15 minutes before a match ends. 
unless I'm playing Amber Rain, that's most of the time below 10 minutes or something. And I started off with Amber Rain, doing lots of uh, matches with Amber Rain, because she's just so great. And also played a little bit of Bainbow. So here comes a Fireball, taking me down to 12. Maybe I should add one of these cards that say... Um, he's not playing any allies as well. Um, well, he just, he's just going to die, for sure you're in terror. Um, yeah, maybe I should play the card that say, says heal your hero for 4 damage and remove all negative effects. Let's see if you can hit him down. I hope he's drawing some allies or something, not burn cards. Here comes the Tome of Knowledge, the witch sucks. And this Dark Claw deck has worked out pretty fine. Oh, this is a nice draw. Um, let's get rid of... I do think we can get rid of this one. Just hold if you're in terror, you never know what's coming. Or, oh, let's just discard it. And I play two fear and terror, but he's going to die terribly from his ability. So, and it sucks that we didn't have a speed strike yet. Let's destroy that one. And pump up our weapon. And yeah, a speed strike would be really good. And I'll put a link of the deck description below. And I'm only going to remove one. Um, one of the cards that say two resources destroy target ally with cost and cost three or less. I forget about its name. I'm going to move one of that and put in a ley line nexus. Or the card that say uh, remove all negative effects and heal your AO for five. So I'm staying at seven here. This is pretty risky. I don't think I'm going down. Let's get rid of this one, I think. Yeah, let's get rid of one of these. I could do them two plus another two, that's four damage. And it would be dead by next turn. But I don't think I will survive. Because he has seven mana. And I have exactly seven lives, so two fireballs or a lightning strike and a fireball will be enough. So I'll put a link of the deck description below and also a list of the new Shattered Fates cards. And yeah, this has just been a bad match. I was close, but I didn't draw the speed strike, so that's sad. But some more Dark Lock content is coming away. And let me know what you liked about uh, audio and video, and we'll see you next match. Cheers!